Thief time. Hello. Alright, I'm gonna play Thief now. I've played Thief Gold a few times through a couple of missions. I've never actually beaten the game or even got halfway through. I'm um, looking forward to it, I think. Uh, I had problems with one of the missions, which I think made me stop playing. Not consciously, I just sort of stopped playing. I had a certain mission where it was like a tomb raiding sort of mission, and I thought it was weird and didn't... I didn't enjoy that mission particularly, so I just sort of stopped. And I looked online and apparently there's a few of those, because um, they weren't... Apparently they weren't sure what game they were really making when they were first working on it, or something like that. They were sort of experimenting, which is fine. Um, I'll see if I enjoy that mission more now. I think it was only two or three missions in or something. Maybe three. I don't know. We'll find out. Let's play. Um, we're playing hard, I think. It seems like a good balance, because... Hang on. Do I remember how to play? I roughly remember. I think we should probably just skip the training. Um, I think hard requires you to still exfiltrate after stealing the main object and steal a few... Because in normal, you don't have to actually leave the mission. You just go and steal the object, then it ends, I think. On hard mode, I believe you have to exfiltrate as well, so leave the premises. Um, and it also requires you to steal um, some extra gold and such along the way, which I think that's a good balance. This one's similar to this, except you can't kill anyone. I think you can't kill anyone that isn't a guard on hard and normal. Do whatever you want, so we'll do hard. And we'll skip training and hope for the best. I have a simple job planned for this evening. Break into a guarded mansion, steal another fat nobleman's priceless trinket, and leave quietly. Lord Bafford is out of town, and rumor has it that the captain of his house guard went with him as a bodyguard. The time is ripe for a bit of burglary. The front gate of Lord Bafford's manor is always guarded, and the main street is far too exposed. But Cuddy tells me there's a better way in, around to the side, more out of the way. One guard, and likely no witnesses to complicate matters. The piece Cuddy wants is a scepter, silver, jewels, the usual adornments. It should command a high price. Bafford, like most of his kind, probably keeps his treasures on the top floor of the place, close to his heart, and far from his servants. No point in waiting. I have Cuddy's old sketches of the place and everyone who's going to be asleep inside already is. It's time to begin. So, sneak into Lord Bafford's manor and case the place. Well House in back is your best bet. I think I remember that place, this little well area with one guard in front of it. Yeah, if you get the key from the guard. Blackjack and pickpocketing. Alright, steal the scepter. Steal 350 more. Um, I think you have to steal something more like 700 on expert, but hard's a good way to start this game off, I think. Um, don't kill any of the servants. Okay, but I can kill guards and stuff if I need to get out of the manor and back to the city streets. Yeah, before I played this on normal, um, well, the first few missions on normal, and yeah, you didn't have to actually leave the manor. 
and I kind of like the exfiltrating part of these stealth sort of games, so yeah. Cool. I hope the audio is good. I'm just going to adjust it as I'm playing and see if I can um, get it rather balanced, but you know, starting gear, water arrow, bone, broadhead arrow, healing potion, sword, blackjack. Cool. So I'm not aiming to play perfectly. I often play stealth games as a total perfectionist. I'm really good at Hitman, Dishonored, all those sort of things. Hitman's less of a stealth game, it's more, you know, a puzzle game, but, you know, I uh, play, when I play a stealth game, I usually try and go for perfection, but I'm going to try something else. I'm just going to try, um, deal with things as they crop up, sort of adapt um, to the situation. I'm not going to save and reload all, all, all over the place and, you know, I just want to try a more natural, free-flowing sort of approach. Alright, we've already seen that. Um, let's do this. Oh, do I need any of that? Nah, let's go. Okay. I'm trying to remember the controls as we go. Hmm. A few too many to try hey. to get by I'm here. going to the bear pit out of here, rogue. Must this is no place for you. Things. So we have control is crouch, so is C, shift is like crouch, but it's hold to crouch, not um, toggle crouch. I, I should mention I have a mod called T-Fix installed, which lets me play widescreen. The mod, um, it comes with a lot more um, enhancements, but I turn them all off because I don't feel that it's best to play I threw a game the first time with a bunch of mods, I don't want to see what the developers originally intended for the game. I just disagree with, um, you know, oh, let's up all the textures by redoing them all, because you often lose the charm of the original experience, in my opinion. But that's just me. It's all cool if you want to do it like that. What's this? I like how they have electricity that's in... It, it shows that you're not in our timeline necessarily, yeah. Whatever that is. What's this? Oh, let's go this way. <laughs> See what we can find. Hmm. Did we just come from there? Yeah. We were down here. Hmm. I might adjust the audio a little. Drop it down a little bit, maybe. I don't know what this EAX thing is. I think it's like the audio echoing or something. But it doesn't seem to work on my computer at the moment. That's alright. There's another ladder. A door. Hmm. Ah, so that opened this portacolis thing. Um, this is hopeful. Stuck. Nope. No, I'm not. Right click. No. Jump. Yeah, jump onto it. We're just pulling up. Alright. I throw this. He doesn't care. Hey there, friend. Could you What's with the crazy more? get up? <laughs> How do I deselect something? Oh, my sword, don't need that. Um, 
Nope. Car drops things. Q and E. F. T looks up. That's kind of useful. I don't know. Oh well, let's figure it out as I go. I'm confused. Maybe I should have done the tutorial. Tutorial, I don't know. Uh oh, am I gonna die? No. Nice. All right. Let's take that healing potion now. And we got one. Oh, it goes up slowly. That's cool. Hmm, I don't want to risk going down there. Inside at last. Alright. Oh, so we have the map here. Okay. I pressed M for map. A trip draws. So we went past that guy at the well. Yeah. Hard to say. Okay. I've been the sir could really beef up security so. So what is what save? What's wrong with us? Let's find out what save is. If there is a save button. No, I'll just do manual saves. That seems like a better way for me not well, to save scum all the time. But I've been thinking we should watch the outside. That's stupid. People to worry about there on the inside. No, then you catch them before they get inside, you taffer. Oh, He's not too bright. So that light meter at the bottom, see that? Now I'm in the shadows, it's fully dark, so they can't see me, I don't think. Yeah, now it gets lighter, so they can. Makes sense. Okay. I don't know the rules for leaning. Can they see me when I'm leaning? I'm not sure. We should check this room for gold and stuff. I should mention I'm playing in a really bright room at the moment, so it's hard to see in the dark, but whatever. Who's that there? Identify yourself! Uh oh. This ain't starting out too well. I'll find you. Damn you. Let's just run. Wait, All right, let's not just run. <coughs> nice. I'm assuming that's a knockout, not a kill. Yeah, unconscious body. Cool, put him in there. I'm also assuming that um, shadows act on guards, like shadows, uh, like uh, wake, awake guards can't see unconscious or dead guards in the dark, hopefully. Said that. Hmm. Is that a spade. Yeah. How do you drop things? I was R, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, that's where we started, I think, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it is, says the guard. Okay, let's go this way then. So I'm pretty sure guards can hear me more on this surface than they can on this sort of surface. Or this metal surface sounds really loud, so they can hear me there. Hey! Yeah, yeah. Come out at once! I can try our um, bone arrow if I have it. <sighs> Oops. Where am I aiming for? Is it the top? So if I aim like this, this ain't working too well. Hmm. Am I aiming like that? No. Like that. Who's there? Oh. Who what made that noise? What? I'm confused. Uh oh. Ah! Whoa. Got oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Over here! Oh no, 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 no. Where's my sword? There's my sword. Am I running? How do I run? Is this running speed? Oh no. Okay, let's, um, let's, uh, um, let's not go that way, let's just run. What's this? Is it an apple? Apple. I wonder if I can eat the apple. Nice. Nothing there. I've only got one health left, this is not going well at all. Okay, reminder, try not to use broadhead arrows, they don't seem to work too well. I imagine because they're wearing helmets. And Where I couldn't figure out how to fire it before. Go! Oh, I should probably get a sword, shouldn't I? Come back! Running speed is... Uh, minimal. I'm pretty sure this is running speed. Uh, if it's not, I'm sure I'll get directed in the comments if anyone watches this, that this game inside and out. That was a loud sound. We can take them. You see anything recently? Well, I'm dead. Good start. Yeah, I earned that skull and crossbones. Well, I managed to sneak in at least. Um, Stats. Only took me less than 12 minutes to die. Found nothing at all. Picked one pocket, knocked one guy out. Oh, you can backstab, that's good. Damage dealt 18, damage taken 2. I wonder if they can wake up guards. Other guards can wake up other guards, I'm not sure. Yeah. I didn't do too well. But I dealt the same amount of damage as they gave to me, so that's good. So I guess. Load. Okay, this puts me back a few minutes, but I've been thinking they weren't particularly. The circuit really beef up security, so. What do you mean? What's wrong with us? Well, we're fine, but I've been thinking we should watch the outsides more. That's stupid. People to worry about there on the inside. No, then you catch them before they get inside, you taffer. Oh. Try the backstab. Just sneak up and stab. Yeah. Get erect. 
<laughs> yeah, this is, feels weird. I usually play this sort of game just completely non-lethally, completely stealthy. No one ever knows I even existed. But, uh, it's alright to play lethally sometimes. I'm definitely kind of a crappy thief in the first place, so might as well ham it up. Let's use the sword a lot. That sounds fun. No rules. Take the shovel. I wish you could use it like you could in Far Cry, where you just piff it at someone's head like a spear. Not quite. Well, I'll keep coming back here. Yeah, I'm very much looking forward to playing this game. I'm surprised I was put off so easily by that um, one... I think I mentioned this, that one level with the, like, tomb raiding sort of thing, but... Oh, no, usually, I'm there. usually I'm quite tolerant of that sort of thing, but... Uh-oh. There we go. Fall into the box, please. Let's eat the apple. Does the apple actually give me more health? I didn't check. I don't know. I don't think so. Maybe there's like half half health bars that are not depicted. I'm not sure. Okay, upstairs. I don't know if there's loot to get downstairs, but I couldn't find it. Um, hopefully the audio quality is alright. I haven't recorded for a while, so I'm just getting back into it. I'm planning next year to... I'll probably make a little update video about this. Um, not that anyone watches, except one person. But, um... And since I'm in here, Ooh. I might as well pick up something for myself. Nice. Who am I working for? I don't know. And why am I auto-picking up stuff inside things? It's probably a setting for that. You know what? I'm going to change it. What was I saying? Um, oh yeah, I'll probably make a little update video on it. this, but I'm planning to make at least one video a week next year as a little challenge. Um, just a hobby to do something, you know? Uh, what's this? Left, right. Ooh, that's weird. I don't know if that came through, but it has a fully stereo left, right? Left, right. Yeah, that's cool. Um, maybe in part two, if I make a part two, I'll f see if I can get this EAX thing working. Because I don't like things to be off. Okay. What am I doing? What am I doing again? I can't remember. Oh dear. Oh yes, um, auto pickup. What is such bodies? Maybe it's that. Letters. Let's just make that touch. Um, look spring, don't know what that is. I'm just gonna try to turn that off, see what happens. Sorry, this is quite unprofessional, but this isn't my profession, so I can do whatever I want. Yeah, these are the ones that are search, right? Yep. I'm really all over the place today. Not not on my best game, but I'm having fun. It's nice and relaxing. I got a new job recently, so um, it's good to night. It's good to play games on my um, days off. Oh dear. <laughs> My new job, I'm working up to like 13 hour day. I worked for 13 hours the other day, which was... I'm not used to that, but I really enjoyed it. Um, I also really enjoy just playing games as well, though, sometimes. And I also enjoy recording, just because... Uh, I don't know why. It's just nice. I don't know what the parameters are to get a perfect, like, backstab like that. I think it's just right in the middle or something, but... Yeah. What's this? Goblet. Don't need that, really. Okay. I find myself using C to crouch a lot more than Control or Shift. I think, um, I'm used to Dishonored uses C.
I really like the feeling of just being lost, you know? The fact that the fact that the maps are um like this, sort of hand drawn and not comprehensive. It's quite nice. Um this video I saw about um Thief that I'm sure someone in the comments, if there's anyone, will um be able to find this video. Um or I might find it, I'm not sure. But it's a video about Thief and it mentions map design a lot. Um and they do yeah, I'll see that. It lights up I think where I am. That's quite good. Um, it talks about how the maps in the game are like a really important part of the gameplay and that they don't just tell you exactly where you are and such, they, they're hand drawn by the character, so they're diegetic maps. Um, it's quite cool. Um, yeah, I'll see if I can find that video, if I remember to. I also was going to merge this channel with my um, other channel, where I post small little edited videos. Um, I've only made two or three so far, I think three, but um, I decided this channel is best left by itself. I think it's a good um, good name, good concept, and I enjoy just having it separate. Even if um, like the other channel got like 50 subscribers, this one only has a few, but um, I don't know how many subscribers, like three or something, but... <laughs> Um, the other channel, I was going to put up my videos from this channel over there, just because it has more subscribers now, but, um, I don't know. I just like this channel. It's nice and little, it's fun, so I'm going to keep it. Ooh, I'm visible here. I wish I could get the arrows to work better, but uh, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm hoping for some secret passages in this game. I do like a good secret passage. Nice. I was hoping this painting would move. <laughs> yeah, I've already got my next game in this um, on backlog queued up to play. It's um, it's another 3D game, pretty old as well. Um, I played it when I was a kid and at a friend's house, and I really enjoyed it. I specifically like to find out, and this was with most games at my friend's house, I like to find out how you could die in the game. Like, do you die if you jump off that? Do you die if you fall off this? And, uh, I don't know, maybe it annoyed him, I don't know, but it's quite funny. We laughed about it the other day. Ooh. Must have been rats. Oh, they say they're in Dishonored. Must have been rats into everything. Hey, that's cool. Oh, what was that? Oh. Seems peaceful enough now. Okay. See how the light meter changes when I lean, so they can probably see me. Let's go upstairs. Oh, this chest. So turning off that option didn't change auto looting chests, but whatever. Maybe it's good, I don't know. So in, in one of the towers. Uh oh. Help! Help! Ah! 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 Oh! Okay. Hopefully no one heard that commotion, because it was quite loud. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm gonna save. I'm also enjoying this um, just sort of non perfect stealth through so far. Oh, we're outside. Yeah, let's check around here first. I wonder if he reads them or if it's just for show. Yeah, Lord Baffert. What's that? Wait. I wonder if you can read this. Oh, you can. Milord. Milordi Buffett. Oh, sorry, this is in sort of a, uh, what's it, slang sort of English. Milordi Buffett. Speaks his cell to Guinea. Did you bid? Drekbo the Hammerhearts. Oh, I don't even understand this. <laughs> Speaks his cell to Guinea. Ginny. Did you bid? Drekbo. Drekboon. The Hammerhearts have been afoot. A skulk. A ferret and about. Oh. 
So the Hammer Hearts, I'm not sure who they are. Hammer Hearts have been afoot, a skulk, a ferret and about, grabbing many a one to vanish in the cold stone down below their f forge, forge e chain cells. Tux, they your dealer. Itaki, Itaki? Itakis? Itaki, I don't know. In their clutches, night passed, and the patrons as well, and two patrons as well. Named of Lizelle and Rien. Scupped up as they left, and those not the first. Cries Guinea. Ginny. Yeah, that's tricky to read. <laughs> I can sort of understand it. Well, it's forgotten. I like how they've written it like this, though. Um, it's once again in world, it's not just a writer writing it. And in perfect English, it makes. There's a little bit of translation required. Um, little wonder, then, if Drekberg grows sparse come these days. Of course, they lack O to blame one hand, but I give. Ginny, let's just say Ginny. A firm understands the blood. A firm, firm understands the blood and doom in the whole book. So we'll be learning him and human about. He'll be learning human all he can about how to turn their hammers off him. Never you fear. About your Victoria, nothing yet. Walks and walks she an inch above the ground for all the dirt of her footprints I have found, Dominic. Yeah, I'm a little confused, but that was interesting. <laughs> cool. Can we read this one? Lord Bafford. This looks easier. A recent delivery of antiquities from Bone contains several items which we felt might be of interest to you. Descriptions follow, but you are welcome to drop by our shop to examine them or our other goods in person. This probably tells us about this scepter. There it is, an ornamental scepter, three feet in length. The body of the stave is weirwood, carved in the star and dot pattern. Six inches of the ferrule and five inches of the grip, bound with burnished, burnished copper overlaid, copper overlaid by an ink and glaze. Cracker varnish. The crowning feature of this magnificent piece, however, is the six inch teardrop cut. Cloudstone, one of the finest of its type we have seen. A treasure box of two th feet by three feet of silver birch wood. The lid is of inlaid pearline and onyx, oink? I should know how to say that. Um, on onyx, on whatever. In a maze pattern carved into the wood, the feet are lion paws, each clutching a crystal globe. The inside of the box contains two principal compartments, one with glass shelves and one without. Beneath the compartments is a lockable two-inch false bottom for your most valuable treasures. Okay, that's interesting. Grimworth and D. Perrin, fine antiquities and precious relics. Okay, so a two, three, three feet silver birch wood. So we're going to look for the feet of, that are lion paws clutching a crystal globe, and we'll look for a false bottom, assuming this is here. That's interesting. How do I get rid of this? There we go. Very interesting. That looks valuable. Nice. 267 so far. Getting there. I'm very interested in the, um, that box. Let's save again. I don't want to say too much to preserve some tension. But I guess the mere act of saving already negates some of the tension anyway. Dear, where is he gonna come up to? Can I distract him? Who's creeping around there? Uh oh, flash bomb. I'm just spamming click. Uh oh. I think that was heard, because that was fairly loud. This is terrifying. Yeah, I don't know how block works. Maybe it's click at the same time as he swings. Strange noise. Oh no. You can't hide for long. I was going to. What the hell? Who's been? Fire this bonehead arrow to make a distraction behind him and then knock him out or stab him. Come out here, I dare you! But that didn't work. 
because I accidentally threw a flash bomb. I swear it wasn't intentional either. Is that where we came up from? I don't know. I'm sorry to any thief perfectionists watching this, but I'm not that. If I ever do a Dishonored playthrough or something, um, I'll be a bit better. I played some Dishonored on this channel with a friend, um, but I don't know how perfect I was. Honestly, some of the fun is locked. Some of the fun comes from chaos. Let's see that key works. I've got two keys. Nice. I really Hello? should shut my blinds Show yourself. in my room. Uh oh And you're dead! Don't try it! Ah. This ain't good, this ain't good. I was saying I really should shut ah. the blinds in my room because I can't see much in the dark. Ah. I wish to unlock the door while in combat and I'm dead. Whoops, I earned the following skull and crossbones once again. Okay, I'm gonna reload. This is fun. I hope this is enjoyable for whoever's watching because it's it's quite entertaining for me. Okay, let's get in the dark. Let's try my um, original plan. Let's see if it distracts me. Show yourself. Yeah. Now I can go and knock him out. As soon as I find you! <clears throat> nice. And that's the key. Ooh. Didn't come in here before. Valuables. Objective complete. Nice. I have enough valuables. But I'll keep stealing stuff because it's fun. Nice shot. Uh oh. Did they hear that? I think I'm not playing on expert, I'd probably have a lot of trouble not killing a single person, given my current track record. I wonder if they can see doors being shot. Like, I believe in Dishonored um, 2, they can... Hey, they freak out if a door's open. That? Stuff like that. Oh no. Come back out here, you taffer! Stop it once and put your hands up! Oh no. Oh no. Uh, uh, it's genuinely freaky. Okay, patience, patience. I'm trying to remember the keyboard shortcuts. One is sword, two is blackjack, three is burnt head arrow, four is water arrow, which we haven't used yet. That's all. So if I stay in this carpet, he might not be able to hear me. Nice. <clears throat> and he can I hear I heard something. Nice. Okay. That's a really good mechanic. Now, hopefully, he doesn't come down here. Where are we? We're in there, okay. Come out here, I dare you! Oh no, I'm sorry for all the deaths. Pure patience. Okay. That's what I need. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna 
in my broad header tactic. Like that. And fire. Come out, you! I heard that! Nice. Come back out here, you taffer! Turn around very slow. Well. The hallway chronicles dying over and over again. <laughs> I've got to start on this carpet, else you will. Show yourself! Blackjack. Come on now, come on! <clears throat> Perfect. Much better. Is that a door? I can't even see. It's so dark. Nice. Oh, no, he's in the way. Alright. Put him there. Something over there. Objective again. Um, I'm too good at this. Uh oh. Oh no, 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 no. I heard that. Show yourself. I mean it. Just you wait till I find you. I just feel inclined to whisper all the time now. So do I have the right key? Yes. I'm scared to go in there. Let's save again, actually. I'm saving way more than I expected I would, but honestly, I'm so bad at this that it's worth it. gongs do probably just create complete mayhem so I'm not going to do that this room looks familiar it's a throne room how pretentious can you get I feel like I've been here before in my first playthrough I remember it oh I remember why I remember it because here we go there's the scepter Great running speed. Run. Oh, no, no, no. This is hilarious. I can't see myself surviving this, but we're going to try. The rice on my tail. I don't think we're going to find that 
clawed chest fall soon. that we saw in that book, but whatever. Let's run. Please be water that I can jump into. Oh no. Alright. Okay, so Okay. No. I was gonna say if I swing at the right time I can block. And proceed to not demonstrate that at all. Saint Mark, and I'm gonna reload that one because it's just gonna end in the same death. Let's try this door. Oh wait, he's facing this way, isn't he? No. Hey, stop! Don't move! How am I gonna do this? Alright, I gotta think. I gotta think cleverly. I wonder if I can jump between the carpet pieces. Don't make me come find you! say before it looks like they can't hear the arrows when they fall into the carpet it seemed like that then at least which is interesting get back hey stop don't move Probably not going to end well, so let's try this. Hopefully they're blinded enough to not know where I went. Hmm, maybe that worked. Genuinely having trouble seeing in this light in my room. Is this something like, like a ends ends um, and I can't go anywhere? I'm not sure. See if there's a way out down here that I couldn't see. 
because that ain't sounding too good. Maybe on the ground, trapdoor or something. I'm hoping it leads to the sewers if there is something. That would be really helpful. Is there anything here? Not that I can see. That's a book. Just a bunch of payments. Pretty sure there's no exit down here. But that's where I can get a key for those doors without knocking out a guard. That's interesting. Alright. Hopefully they've given up. But with my luck, I'm probably going to run into one the moment I run up these stairs. Alright, looking good. I can't blame it on my luck. It's just my hard skill. Oh dear, here it goes. All right, where are you? Well, that was expected. All right, I'll try again. I think I have to do. So he's facing that way. He turns to the right and looks that way. Um, I have to wait until he faces that way again. Then I'm going to jump between the carpet, run up and knock him out. Um, there it is. So he's currently facing forwards, I think. Turn it over there, I can try this. Let's try this. Nope, he does not care about that at all. Yes, he does. Never mind. I'll find you! Just you! Perfect. <laughs> it's a throne room. How pretentious can you get? That was good. Alright, save time. Saving my way through this level. Whatever. There are unfortunate parts of me that want to hit those gongs very badly, but I'm not going to. Well, you can find that um, chest full of interesting things. Okay, so the gold ones seem to be worth something. Was it a chest of interesting things? Oh yes, there's a fake bottom, doesn't it? That was it. I wonder if those bottles, I wonder if I can throw them and I, won't, I will lose the money, but use them as a distraction. I don't know. I'll just save and test. No. That'd be a cool mechanic. I'd like that. What's that? A ring. Cool. Looks like gold, gems, and goods are split up into different sections in the bottom right corner. And total. That's, that's cool. Did that Okay, well, I survived that, so that's good. I'm not going to reload. It's in front of me, isn't it?
Hmm. I like that I was tricked by that. Staff. The sir will be taking his dinner and evening out tonight. So domestics and manservants of the night free. Housekeeper is still expected to finish the quarters and the general polish. The house guard is not to find this is an opportunity to shirk and lapses will be brought up with the sir. Cedric or Cedric or whatever. Okay. Okay, let's try and run. Let's just go. Drop that weapon! Don't move! Don't know where I'm going. I think it's this way. Oh no. Oh no, I went dead. Die, Tapper! Ah! Well, quite dead. objectives at least. Twenty minutes thirty nine seconds. Eight forty out of fourteen twenty nine. Pretty good. It's more than half. Three out of four pockets picked. Two backstabs, three knockouts. Six three damage to help, twelve taken. One body discovered. Pretty good. Alright, well, I'll end the first part here, or should I be watch the cutscene? I don't know. Yeah, let's, I'll end it here, and we'll watch the cutscene in the next part, because I feel like I'm going to make more than one part of this game. Cool. Thanks for watching. <laughs>